Hey, welcome back to another episode of Nights at Fringe. We're joined by another Fringe artist. Geneva is here to talk all things Split Lip. But before we do that, Geneva, you need to do a 10 second pitch for your show. The camera is there ready to go whenever you're ready. Okay, Split Lip is a exploration of mental health and trauma through the medium of spoken word lip syncing. I'm a drag artist and this is what I do very well. It has had a lot of accolades, um, weekly awards, it was shortlisted for the Martin Sims Award for the Overall Theatre Award and just recently won the Sydney Fringe Tour Ready Award but unfortunately I wasn't able to go because of COVID. <laughs> great pitch and great show in terms of um, a different a different vibe, I suppose, um, with the with the issues involved. What brought you to to those sort of things for the show? Well, initially it started as a creative process to try and figure out how to do a show revolving around spoken word lip syncing, which is what I do very well. And then I had already developed these characters that were very popular through the drag scene that I perform in. And then all these different characters together tried to find a right medium and then it kind of developed into this idea of, oh, they could be personalities. And then why would they manifest and why would they exist? And then it became a bit more of a deeper personal creative thing of them being representative of like personal traumas that I've been through in my life. And yeah, so what became a very comedic spin on dissociative identity disorder and multiple personalities actually became a bit more of a uplifting personal story. What also sounds really tough is the, is the lip syncing element uh, to spoken word. Is it just one spoken word track throughout the whole show? Yeah, it's basically one spoken word piece from start to finish, but it's not through song, it's mainly through like um, slam poetry and monologues and things like that. And for those who aren't uh, spoken word familiar, what is, what is spoken word specifically? So spoken word lip syncing is the same as lip syncing to a song, but you're lip syncing to dialogue from excerpts from film, television, sometimes I take from internet videos and um, comedic stand-up specials and slam poetry. What I found is you're trying to memorize the rhythm in which certain dialogues are spoken, kind of like the rhythm of a song. You just have to kind of find the rhythm of someone's mm. normal speech pattern. So Split Lip features Geneva, and Geneva also has her messy friend show as well. Where's Geneva coming from uh, for you? Geneva is my drag persona. Right. And what Geneva's Messy Friends is, it's a kind of like a retrospect on 10 years of my drag career and Fringe and the shows that I saw back in 2011 really influenced how I perform and along the way in the last 10 years the people that I've met and the Perth performers I think are so strong and so influential and I wanted to kind of give thanks and show my love to them and do a show mainly for them. You can catch Geneva and her show Split Lip here at the Girls School 15th of Jan all the way through to the 31st and then Geneva and her messy friends take to the stage in February. Geneva, thank you so much for joining us here at Nights of Fringe. It's been a pleasure. Thank you for having me.